We're back at you today with some drills that you can do using a wall and a tennis ball. First thing we're going to do is throw some grounders that come right back at me. And what we're going to work on here is making sure that our head is over the ball and working on what they call for the little kids the alligator chop, where we bring our hand down over top of the ball. Okay? So we're going to do 10 reps of those. Then we're going to turn our bodies and we're going to work on forehands. And when you're fielding a forehand, you're not using both hands, so you're just gonna use one hand for this and work through the ball with your hand. Notice that my hand is pointed down at the ground. Okay, and then we're gonna turn our bodies and we're gonna work on the back hands. On the back hands, we wanna make sure that our thumbs are pointed at the ground. One thing you'll notice here is that my head is moving over top of the ball. I'm not reaching out like this. My head is coming right down over top of the ball. Okay, and you'll get your glove on your knees same drills. Okay, 10 reps, just watching the ball into your glove. Okay, then you'll turn to your forehand. Same thing. 10 reps with your forehand. Okay, making sure that you're working through the ball. Okay, then we'll turn over to our backhand. Same thing. Make sure your eyes are following the ball all the way into the glove. Okay, and then lastly, what we're going to do is we're going to get up. We're going to do the same thing, standing up. Stay squatted down. And you work on balls right at you. Okay, then you're going to turn your forehand. Okay, then you're going to turn around to your backhand. Eyes on the ball. Working through the ball. One other thing you can do is just throw the ball against the wall. Wherever it goes, you go get it. Okay, and this drill we're going to work on is for outfielder. So what we're going to do is he's going to throw the ball against the wall up and, and work on going back on the ball and catching it. And then he's going to work the other way. All right, this next drill is great for hand-eye coordination. You can even make this competition set a timer to see how many you can get within a certain amount of seconds, say like 30 seconds. Go ahead. So you want to go as quick as you can, start off slow, throw, switch hands, throw the next ball, throw, switch hands, go the next ball. Of course, one other thing you can do is just have the kids hit tennis balls to each other to work on their grounders. And this is a drill that my six-year-old insisted would be very helpful for other six-year-olds.